Who's excited? First live 4K transmission from space ever. Let's get right to it. Johnson Space Center, can you do the audio check? Coming. We should hear it in the room very shortly. Okay, here we go. Hello, Commander Fisher and Colonel Fish Commander Whitson and Colonel Fisher. It is an honor for all of us and those online to join you and all of your colleagues at NASA in the first ever live 4K stream from space. What is the ISS position in orbit right now? Eleven seconds. Well, we're just passing over Baja, California, and we're heading in an arc over North America. By the time we finish talking, we'll be over Central Africa. Wow. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. Before we learn more about NASA's Amazing, amazing. Central Africa. Wow. <laughs> amazing, amazing. Before use of Live 4K, I'd like to share about Peggy's exciting achievement that was recently made on the ISS and in space. Peggy, you've made eight spacewalks and you recently set the record for the most days in space by an American astronaut. Congratulations. <laughs> what inspired you to become an astronaut? It's an inspiration to thousands of students in the United States and the entire world, so thank you so much. Now, of course, we're calling from the NAB show here in Las Vegas, where next generation broadcast and production technology comes to life. Are there any films about space that have truly inspired you? For me, it was definitely the right stuff. As a to have the Soyuz launch, but we are anxiously awaiting and looking forward to greeting our new crewmates up here. Well, is there any chance that your mission might be extended? And, and if so, what's the word on when you'll be returning? And how do you feel about spending potentially some extra weeks up there? Yeah, so we're still waiting to hear word from all of that, and of course the, uh, our Russian partners are going to let us know as soon as they have any word. Welcome to the cupola. Ready to play a little music? Indeed. Your uh, scenery looks a little nicer than ours. 
Um, 